Hey everyone, it's Brendan the Paleo Dude. I'm out at Toys R Us in um, Edmonton and they've got all new figures. They've got the Dr. Grant uh, Amber Collection, which is insanely cool. We're finally getting that. Um, oh my god, they've also got Robert, which is new. I did not see this. Whoops. <laughs> oh my goodness. So he comes with a uh, electric prod or something and he doesn't come with his like signature weapon, which is kind of sad. Grant comes with a flare and a little uh, claw, which is really neat. Um, they've got all the typical stuff on here, but they also have these guys for a great price of $13 each. That's actually really cheap for up here because um, usually we get like abysmal prices on these guys, 17 each, crazy. Um, but no, I'm excited that these new um, figures are out because you can see they're really, really nicely painted. They've got some cool patterns on them, very colorful. Uh, the Mononychus is one of my favorites from the line, um, just due to all this striping that they put into it. Um, and the, the nice, like, shades. You got some browns, some reds. They didn't just put red on the tail. It's, it's very uh, diverse coloration. The teeth are really nice, too. They got this um, green raptor. Um, and then they got Ramparinkus. Loving the colors on that. That is looking really nice with the orange and the white and like this kind of like blackish, maybe a little bit of blue in there. And this raptor is cool. Um, it doesn't have a name, so it's not one of the, uh, the usual, but the paint job on it's actually really decent for once. It's got a nice soft um, yellowy white beige-ish color on the chin, the bottom jaw, and then some really good coloration around the eye it's outlined with that darker color and then it has the orange pupil i don't know if there's extra details there but i, I love the slit eye too and the colors continue on the tail which is really nice and then they've got the baby brachio and they've got ali Ramis back there and then they've got this new guy the uh syringosaurus uh it looks like the uh the devil dogs or whatever they're called from uh, Ghostbusters, so that's crazy that they'd add this guy. I think he's from the Permian, or Triassic Permian. And uh, of course they, they made the head look not accurate, but <laughs> it's Jurassic World. Um, this body's looking off color from the rest of the ones. Let's get a different one. I, maybe they're all like that? I think it's just a camera lens. It, it looks a lot better in person. Um, <laughs> Though it looks rough on camera, look at that orange body and yellow legs, they're fading or something. You can see the necks on a really large ball joint, it's got um, really nice articulation there, like the back of the neck too. Um, you can see the details, they've got this almost symmetrical, it's still kind of um, graded down the back, little bumps, which is really nice. Um, the jaw's got articulation too but you can see the articulation um, connector joint. It, it, it's not that flush with the neck. If you choose to ignore that triangular cut, it's pretty much fine. Yeah, no, that's really cool that they'd include, um, I guess that's a mammal-like reptile into the, the lineup, into the diversity. But yeah, no, really great prices with that. They've got the original Roaring Rat. The one that shakes, it's got like a rubbery tongue too. Um, this one's from the old lineup. And I think they've also got, whoops, they got these guys from the original lineup with the uh, little action features. The um, Tiger Stripe Raptors are really cool. Great for pack building and photography for Isla Sorna stuff. Um, they got the Rex, the new one with the pink and nails and capture gear, which is really cool. I'm kind of shocked that they don't have the Stegosaurus and the Picardontosaurus. Um, those would have been really great. Maybe they sold out already, um, but they got the action feature Scorpius Rex. I don't think they've ever had the Gyrosphere version, but Walmart's got that here, so that's that's good. Tons of candy. So it's got those uh, action features and stuff. And you can see the old lineup on the back. I'm kind of missing seeing it. The Disney Ceratops is really neat. Um, now, what's crazy is they really jacked up the prices on these guys. They used to be 27 and now they are $30, which is 
which is insane. Um, but you can see there's a lot of detail put into these, and especially with the paint job, even this little back button here has paint on it, and they molded that spines into uh, into the plastic. So it's like a different plastic from the, the, the actual switch there. Um, but yeah, no, they've got lots of cool uh, red and white on this guy. One of my favorites, if you watch my previous videos, it looks really sick up close. Like, look at that. Um, the Rhinosaurus is really cool. It's a nice new addition, new species. Um, and plus, since it was featured in the show, it's uh, not too accurate color-wise. I think the uh, show one's brown and purple. But this guy here is... Uh, Chaos, and I think that's it. Um, I know Metricanthosaurus is supposed to be out. And then there's uh, Snap Squads down here, the usual um, for that. Now for Amber Collection, there is Dennis Nedry with the Jeep. I actually haven't seen this one in a while, which is kind of sad that uh, it was off shelves for a bit, but now it's come back, which is really nice. Um, I think they dropped down in price. No, it's it's 47, which is uh I guess not bad if you look at how much figures cost separately. Like that would be 12, that would be 12, and that would be like uh, 30 or something, or less. So that's like 20 something. But no, I'm nice to see it back on shelves before Christmas time. So hopefully some uh, people get that. <laughs> it's a fun set to get. Um, then Patasaurus another legacy figure this one's 90 dollars up here i know the states are having sales on this bad boy for 50 and even less i think like 40 something which is crazy but we can't have anything good up here in canada which sucks um there hasn't been a sale on jurassic world stuff like the states have had for i think since 2018 uh toys r us used to have 50 percent off sales before christmas on jurassic world which was crazy. I miss those times. I would like load up on figures I didn't have. Um, I think one time I spent $150 on $300 worth of stuff. So that really saved me that time, but nothing's saving us now because <laughs> uh, the prices are jacked up and uh, sales are non-existent. Holy cow, that is absolutely new. Thank you, mother. Oh, I saw this on Instagram. Um, <laughs> Uh, what, what is it? Captives. So, uh, Toy Monster, I think it is, the company, was giving these away to people to do reviews, and, and, uh, before the Christmas holidays, they'd, uh, jack up the advertising on it to really sell them, but holy cow, they come with a whole little case, um, a bunch of little dinosaurs. I don't have any of these, they're all new. Um, I, I'm still missing two from the last lineup, and I completed the first lineup, but this case is so cool because you can display them inside. Um, it comes with the exclusive Gold Indominus, so I guess I don't need to track that guy down. That's a cool case. Okay, it looks like I have a place to uh, store them now. That's great. Um, where was that guy? Just sitting down there. And it is... Oh, it's only $30. That's not that bad. And then they have a whole other wall of just doubles and extras of the larger stuff. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, definitely check out some of my reviews on these figures. Uh, so yeah, it'll be on my channel and then I'll link a few in the end part here. So hope you all enjoyed and I'll see you all in the next video then.